Welcome, welcome, welcome back. Hopefully this doesn't get lost in the void because <laughs> OBS just crashed on me. But we're gonna do the team prep anyway. Welcome back, Glaceon. Yeah. What's what's poppin'? Brand new whip no, that's copyright. Um <laughs> We're battling Lex, aka the Chaos Corp. Um, we're lucky to even do this fight, considering they failed to show up to two fights this season. So we're kind of happy that we get to absolutely, absolutely fight this season. Yay! Um, get to absolutely fight. Uh, Glaceon was Bars. sick. Lex is sick, but we're I'm the only one that's not sick. So hopefully that. that I'm not. I'm not sick us. anymore. Oh, it just okay. made it so our battle was way later in the week. Oh, nice. By like you know five days, and okay. I also forgot to mention I was sick and just. No, that was, should. That was me. My um, bad. What are, what, are, what are our concerns for this fight? Um. Oh wait, I for. Oh, thank you. I forgot to pull up their team. I was like looking at our team, and I was like, well, it looks like there's a uh, nothing much. So, but so the the tense <laughs> things for our our team while you pull that up. Uh, Dragapult is fast. Uh, weird oh, there is we. Trick Room and Intimidate. Chandelure hits like a truck. Uh, squawk ability has Intimidate and Final Gambit. Delibird has Fake Out, Tapu Lele is Psychic Surge, um, Ushering is Guts, but I'm not really worried about that. Espeon has um, Expanding Force, Escavalier is going to be scary if it's a lead, um, and then Iron Hands has Fake Out. So, mm -hmm. yeah. You want to get us started on the team? Yeah, sure. All right. Uh, so starting off, uh, it's a very similar set to last week because we're very mad that our strategy didn't work since they brought the exact same one. So uh, starting off, we have Chuck the Ruddy Rock. He's not shiny this week. Uh, and we we're like, what's another name for Chocolate Chunk? And uh, we went with he looks like a Chuck. So so we got Chuck. Uh, uh, so he has Heavy Slam again, just because he's such a heavy Pokemon. It'll do insane damage to their team. Rock Slide uh, hits both Pokemon. It's Stab. Uh, has Drain Punch to get back health. Uh, we were originally thinking of a... Uh, what what move were we going to put on a... I forget. Fire Punch. Fire Punch, right, thank you. Because uh, Fire Punch is also good into some Pokemon on this team, but we decided Drain Punch is also good into a lot of things, and it lets us stay alive for longer. Uh, since uh, we're not really invested in our bulk as much as in our attack. And then we put Protect on this thing, just because we kind of felt like it had to have Protect. Um... And it's the weakness policy set again. Clear body. Because uh, the sturdy thing doesn't matter, right? Yeah, and clear body because they have two Intimidate Pokemon. So we don't want to get on top. I was there. Dust Clops, same right. thing as last time. We got the Frisk, Mental Herb, exact same items. We have the Trick Room, the Bulldoze. We have Will-O-Wisp this time because their team gets bodied by... Like, their attack stats are really, really high, so we're going to take away their attack stats. They're going to do no damage. We're going to take advantage of them. It's going to be all good. We also have Shadow Ball as well, considering almost half their Pokemon are Psychic or just weak to um, Ghost in general. Um, Alright, uh, this uh, this week we got High Dragon, the Iron Chuck. <laughs> <laughs> I thought that name was funny based on our camera up gag so uh, I'm very happy with that name uh, this thing is a booster energy cork drive uh, speed uh, this week uh, and we gave this thing a bunch of special attack investment dark pulse flamethrower air slash uh, that just covers like everything on their team basically this thing is gonna be a beast and with the uh, booster energy speed boost it it's really not gonna be outsped by much except for like does that outspeed dragapult yeah, did we figure that out yeah, so, unless if they're Choice Scarf, this thing is just going to absolutely nuke something. Uh, and then we put Protect on it, uh, just because Protect's good, and we had another Protect slot. Yep. So, uh, yeah. And we Terra Ghosted this thing. Uh, that's uh, That gets rid of some of its weaknesses. Uh, it makes it so we can't get faked out. Uh, just thought I should note that. Yeah, so, our thought process is, I bet you... I feel like they're bringing... Um, Psychic Terrain Expanding Force. That's just the gut feeling that I get. So smart to yeah. have some dark types. So we also have the Greninja here. Um, we want to keep that dark typing. That's why we have Battle Bond. We're Focus Sash as well. We have Matt Block. 
because we outspeed everything except Dragapult and a Scarfer, obviously. So we could map block turn one, get some damage off. Um, this thing is uh, just sped crept to outspeed Espeon. Um, so we have the rest, we have 252 in the special attack so that we can get some massive damage on Dark Pulse and Ice Beam so that we can get our Battle Bond up. After one Battle Bond, we outspeed non-Scarf Dragapult. We also have Gunk Shot on here as well. We're running a mixed set. And the Gunk Shot is specifically for the Tapu Lele if it comes to that. Alright. Uh, next up we got Meowch, the Tor Cat. As for always, Eviolite. Not always what we have on it, but it's pretty consistently our Eviolite Mon. We gave it Intimidate because we wanted an Intimidator. And uh, this thing is not a Fake Out Mon this week. Uh, fake Out doesn't really do a whole lot for us with how many ghost types there are, so we gave it a parting shot for our, uh, like, to give us some, like, flexibility on the field to be able to switch in and out. Uh, we originally had, like, we were messing around with U-Turn, but U-Turn doesn't really do enough damage, and if we have a parting shot, we're just gonna use that if we wanted to get out. Uh, we gave this thing Will-O-Wisp, uh, to lower their attacks on top of Intimidate. Uh, we gave it Flare Blitz and Crunch. Because Crunch hits all these ghost types, and we wanted a strong fire type move, and Flamethrower didn't really do the damage we wanted it to, and we didn't have a good special dark type move, so we thought we should invest in this thing's attack and just give it Flare Blitz to go all out. If Because if we're going to be there to attack, we're probably not trying to switch out anyways. So. Yeah. Next up, we have our okay. Camerupt. This is our Follow Me Pokemon. <clears throat> We've invested a lot in its bulk and not a lot in its attacking moves. This thing has a citrus berry to make it live just a little bit longer. We have our own expanding force, just in case it comes that. Um, the difference between expanding force and psychic really isn't a lot. I mean, base 90 to base 80, right? So expanding force, if we can just hit two Pokemon, that would be kind of nice. We also have Thunderbolt on here as well, considering we don't have electric terrain, so Thunderbolt is our strongest move. And we also have Nuzzle on there to slow some things down, like the Dragapult or maybe a Chandelure or something something like that. Um, do, and, um, you, yeah. do you like Nuzzle on here? I was thinking of we, putting another Protect. Oh uh, right, Map Block doesn't count as one of our Protects, does it? Correct. But also, Let's put Protect on there. I kind of... I don't know why this really. thing would Protect. Oh right, it's our Follow Me. I guess the only scenario is if they're already attacking and expecting to follow me. Yeah, I mean, we could get a Dragapult or a Chandelure to hit into it. Or an Espeon with. Mm. I kind of like Protect more anyways, just because we we have uh, two Will-O-Wisps. And I feel like we're going to be fast. We have a lot of really heavy attackers, and I just don't think Process is going to do a whole lot when our heavy attackers outspeed by so much. Yeah. I like it. Okay. So, uh, on that note, we don't have Nuzzle, we have Protect. Yep, Crazy not. scenes. We have Protect. Um, <laughs> uh, do we want to give this... Terra Electric's our best Terra, right? Just to make Thunderbolt more useful. I think so, and it gets rid of uh, yeah. Psychic. Yeah, I moves. think we discussed that last time, right? Yeah. Like, during the actual team build. Alright. Uh, is there anything else? I don't know, I think that's about it. This is a pretty quick team recap All for right. us. Let's go do the battle. We will see you guys then. Whee! Welcome, welcome, welcome back. Hey, I failed to record the battle live. I recorded about half of it. Uh, so, I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to do a live co or do a commentary of the battle afterward. Um, I haven't decided if I want to do the first half of the battle and then just cut to where we're actually in the battle or not. I'll figure that out after I record this, but I'm going to record it all for you guys here. I'm going to put this on slow. Let's put it on really slow. This will still probably be faster than the actual battle because the actual battle took a while to take our turns. But what happens here at the start, we lead... Um, we lead Regirock and we lead Dusclops, right? Our strategy is to Trick Room, Bulldoze, and then 
you know, rock slide, do, do some massive damage with weakness policy here. We notice they have Eevee Light and they have the Light Clay. So we kind of just go for our strategy right away. We go for the Dunsparce here, I think, with the Drain Punch because Dunsparce can be really, really annoying and it can live for a long time. The little damage we did there, even though Reflect was up, was kind of scary. We were scared because that's not a lot of damage and we got to get through this Dunsparce one way or another. We get the Bulldoze off, we crit two Pokemon here, which is okay, but you know, don't think anything about it. We get our Weakness Policy here. They Coil, and Coil is also not good for us because it is upping their defenses, and we are already scared of not doing any damage. So we do just a little bit more damage, and that is kind of sad. So at this point we're thinking, we gotta get rid of this Dunsparce, they get rid of the Trick Room, which is, eh, not, nor here nor there. We do the Rock Slide just to try to get some flinches, because we are faster. We lowered their speeds outside of Trick Room. We are faster, which is really, really weird, with a minus speed, zero speed Regibon. They get some Rock Slides off on us. We are going to try to, let's see here, we're going to try to will wisp the Dunsparce. We get flinched. And so that is a big deal because we were trying to Will-O-Wisp it and that way it's Rock Slides wouldn't do anything and that was, that was kind of annoying. We take a chunk from this weird ear here. We thought we would die there. They get another Rock Slide and we go for another Will-O-Wisp and we get flinched again. Nice. We could not be happier here. So no Will-O-Wisp comes out. We do get the Drain Punch off, and we do kill that, so it is very annoying, but it is gone. So that is a big, big plus for us. They go for Regirock. Not entirely sure why, but that's okay. We set up another Trick Room. So we're thinking, oh, they can go out to anything, and we'll be all right. Well, they go out to Iron Hands, and we forget about Fake Out for one reason or another. And then we Will-O-Wisp again, and we miss. We love missing. All right, and then we die. Big rip, big rip eraser head. So we decide that in order to get this Iron Hands more manageable, we need to bring in Toro Cat. Bring in Toro Cat for the Intimidate, and we're gonna get one more Will-O-Wisp on, on this thing, which would be awesome when we land it. We get Shadow Balled. Let's see. They Drain Punch us, which we live. And then we get our Drain Punch off. We get a little bit of health back. Not a lot, but just enough. And we miss another Will-O-Wisp. That's four that we have not been able to get off. That is terrible, terrible, tragic luck. Okay. They go to Tapu Lele here. Uh, and we go out into Raichu here. I don't remember why I went out into Raichu. I think we were going to go for a follow me. Um, I think. Oh, we were predicting a drain punch to go into um, that slot, but it didn't end up happening. Okay, very important that re Reflect goes away here. We protect here. Um, and Trick Room is still active. So we protect here because we're going to be slower than a lot of things in Trick Room. And we go for the Heavy Slam on the Lele, which guaranteed Oko's. Very, very big. Uh. So started recording. I'll probably... Uh, what we can do is we can just watch the battle back and give commentary then. I just started recording. Oh, we should act like we're doing it live and just stall with that. Oh, that'd be funny, actually. <laughs> What's up, YouTube? It's your boy Dan. AKA A Drive. It's okay. Nothing has no? happened in this battle, so. Uh... Oh, 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 oh. No, he. Uh, uh, they're doing your intro, Glaceon, because they're a big fan. Uh, it's your boy. That's, that's definitely that's definitely my intro. Yeah. 
Yeah, Eight Drive stole it from you when he was small. He was a small streamer. Welcome, welcome, welcome back! <laughs> <laughs> I've did that since the first video ever on my channel, so it's been like four years. That's commitment. Yeah. Nice! No! Wait. Okay, that's actually like... It doesn't... So, Reggie Rock... Really? So, Weird Deer is faster. Reggie Rock. We should double out um, into something yeah. else here. Wait, Weird Deer can't kill Reggie Rock, though. Weird Deer can't kill Reggie Rock, so we should probably just keep hitting this Espeon, if I'm not mistaken. Can you calculate yep. does more damage? And do we want to go into Torcat, or do we want to go into Raichu? I think we, they have two specials. I think we should go into Raichu, because it's Dude, two Psychic types. Do you think they can kill anything. Greninja? No, we need Greninja. I'm going to keep Greninja. I need Greninja. Yeah, switch Greninja. So, Raichu, um, and then probably, what, Heavy yeah. Slam? It's 120 on, on Espeon. I think. And I think heavy Espeon, slam Terra's Psychic, Fairy, or Normal. So it, do it doesn't matter if it's two of those, and if it's the other one, it's super effective. Yeah. I think we just go for the Heavy Slam because we need the damage on Espeon. Or we could go for the Rock Slide if we want to just get Residual on a Weird Air. Do you want to calc it? Uh, the Rock Slide versus Heavy the Slam? Heavy Slam. See if it does, see if it does uh, max damage. I mean, it's 120. Yeah, that's the max, right? Yeah. Do you think it kills? I don't think it kills. I don't think it kills, but it'll do crazy damage here. I think we... I think a Dazzling Gleam is coming our way, though. Yeah. Do you want to just Heavy Slam without Calcanet, or do you want to Calc it first? I don't think it matters. Okay, let's just... Let's just... We ball, right? Yeah, we ball. Nice. Live. Boom. <laughs> oh, that was beautiful. Another day, another dub. That's why we ball, bro. We count that. That's why we do it. Okay, Iron Hands is coming out. Uh, hear me out. Wait, does Follow Me have more or less priority than Fake Out? We're about to get Faked Out and killed. We are. We have both Protect still. Ursa Ring is in here. Oh, Psychic Terrain's still up. Yeah, and Trick Room is still up. Uh, Shadow Ball's gonna kill Chuck. <laughs> Is it? Follow me. Do we want to follow me here? We could Terra Electric yes. follow me and not die. Does it matter if we Terra Electric? I mean, we live. I know we guaranteed live if we Terra, but do we care? No, I think our other Terras... I yeah, mean, so. I think our Terra Ghost on Iron Jug is better because there's an Iron Hands in the back. But... Oh. I really want to. I mean, we could also. You wanna? I'm fine with that, cause then we proc the citrus probably. Yeah, I think we tear it here just for the defensive, and I. Or. Do you think this Arsenal no. is protecting? It could. Do you want to go for rock slide? You wanna do? I mean, we could just. I hate to double protect here, right? But like. We have to make a prediction here. I think Ursarang. I think Ursarang. It's gonna go for a protect to proc protect. the flame orb. Yeah. I think okay. that means we Terra Electric. And Weirdir is trying to take. And then we yeah, should Terra drain Electric punch follow this me. Weirdier? Yes, drain punch the Weirdir. I think. Well, do you think Rock Slide's gonna do more? Oh, but then we live the next turn of yeah, Shadow Ball. We get, we get a little bit of help. Yep. Back. Okay, do that then. Is this a book? Is this a book that we're reading? Is this how this works? What? I mean, we've made some incredible reads. Oh! This, this, uh, I figured out the, I figured out the word book. Okay, I'm not that smart. Like safety goggles? No, it's like play. <laughs> Our safety goggles wouldn't matter because we're doing follow me instead of... Um, You're so special. Yeah, dude. My brain works a thousand times a minute. And they lost their Terra, and we still have ours. Well, it, not anymore. Dude, it literally works a thousand times a minute. And, and I know that those thousand times are good. Every single one is just... <laughs> it's just bad. Come on. Yeah, 
<laughs> it's either a brisket or it's burning. What if it's lasagna? I haven't been seeing these because I scrolled up to see something else. I don't know why they're thinking so hard about everything. And it'd be nice if this was um, psychic terrain. Exp or, uh, nice. Yeah. That's fine. Oh. Damn, I still did a lot of damage, huh? Alright, so we can. Uh... Uh, do you want to just expanding force here? Oh, yeah. no, it's gone. We it's gone. Oh, shoot. Uh, we can. T bolt weird ear or we can follow me just to prevent damage on Chuck. I I think we just Thunderbolt and Dream Punch here. Yeah, because then we definitely take out Weird Ear. And we do a ton to Ursaring even if it doesn't. Ursaring protected, and it's not there's no way Ursaring slower than our minus speed Reggie Rock right now. Oh and no, definitely not. Yeah, I think we just electric thunderbolt. We're Terra Electric Thunderbolt too, I forgot about that. Are we double targeting our string? Oh. No. Oh, uh, yeah. Oh. Nice. I thunderbolt the damage. cannon hands. Nice crit. Oh! Let's go! Okay, <laughs> the First of all, there's fake out. Um, so we should double, double protect. protect. Yeah, you get it. Um, so the problem is, trick room ends. Well, trick room ends, which means Raichu kills Ursaring next turn. Yeah. And then we will be faster than Iron Hands next turn. Yeah. Yeah, we just double protect. Mm. It's safety. Good thing that Terra Electric followed me really came in handy when they used fucking light screen. <laughs> <laughs> they had so screens clutch, up, bro. They had screens up all battle. <laughs> This is the Those slowest even... battle we've ever had. This is probably the, the longest battle. <laughs> and our, our lead is still Like, in not turns wise. Yeah, but nothing has but died on our side. Wise. I know, it's it's almost infuriating. It's annoying. Watch I've got mark. places to be. Oh, nice. And they can't protect next turn. Hit it. Oh. Okay. Look at that safety net. So that we Thunderbolt beautiful. into the Ursarang, and we, what, Drain Punch into the Iron Hands? Just because it does yeah. a little bit? Or, no, that we have to do that. Because mm. um, Ursarang is faster than Regirock, so we'll have to Drain Punch into the Iron Hands. Yep. Man. That's fine. We still, um, we still kill that. I mean, we're dead here, but... Are we? Ooh. Yeah. No! Hey, um, So hey. we could go into... Tsunami. Hear me out. Yeah, Greninja, Matt Block, take out Ursaring. Yeah, I think so. Even if they protect on Ursaring, then it's still dead the next well, turn, right? I think right? we're just expanding force this Iron Hands, because it hasn't shown us protect. They have... Oh, yeah. Their... Yeah. And then we're still Matt Block, so we don't have to worry about getting hit. And it's another it's another turn chip burn damage so on our hands. That's, force yeah, you're right. Yes. And then map block. Yeah. Or we could just hit this no, it it'll protect. Or something Do map block. Yeah. Map block's the right call here. I don't know if it is or not. I want to use it. It is, block. it's it's a, it's a safety it. net. Well but safety, they can't no, outspeed yeah. us at all. They can't outspeed us, it's for the damage. Uh in case they did attack it. Wow, that did nothing. As I said. Aha! Okay, so now, now I think we... We can... I mean, we can expand the force again and Dark Pulse? The Ursaring? Well, they can protect Ursaring this turn. Since they attacked last turn. What do you want to do? Map protect block? and then we can't double map block. Map block only works mm -hmm. first turn. It's like fake out. We go into Meowch, protect and then go into Meowch, or we could uh, expanding force and then go into Meowch. I think expanding force into Meowch. Expanding force on Iron Hands and Meowch switch in. 
Yeah, I think that little bit of damage is just going to seal the deal for us. Yeah, and we get an Intimidate off, and we can get a Will-O-Wisp if we needed to next turn. Yeah. Oh no! We almost died. We're not going and, for death, yep. it's okay. Doesn't matter. Because then we can map block here. Map block again and kill the iron. Take out iron hands. Yep. Map block and what? Uh, go for flamethrower. Flamethrower. Just for the not miss. Yep. That's I clicked map block, right? Map block and then watch map block not work like I think it does. Let's Oh, if we're fast, I'm more faster than our own. Nice. Good battle. I'm happy with that one. I'm happy with that one.